Hey guys, it's James here from Hoxton Therapy. Uh, if you've got any questions on mental health, um, even if it's not related to the this particular video and you want, want your questions answered, whether it's on depression, anxiety, whatever it is, um, please leave them in the comment section below in this video. Um, we're going to go through all the comments and we're going to try and answer um, any questions that you have in future in future videos. So um, get writing and we're going to try and answer your questions in the future. So in this particular video, we're going to be talking about what psychodynamic therapy is and that's coming up right after this. So I've heard of psychodynamic therapy. What is that? Psychodynamic therapy yeah. Yeah. is very, very different, different to CBT. CBT. Yeah. yeah. The CBT that I've been talking about earlier talking focuses on, on your, your thoughts and beliefs mm. and values. The um, psychodynamic therapy doesn't, doesn't limit itself to that. It, 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 Psychodynamic therapy, like psychoanalysis, mm. aims to help you explore the unconscious. Oh, yeah. We've got this, we've got this reservoir of unconscious stuff. Mm. And that stuff is fantasies, memories that we've forgotten, mm. impulses, desires, wishes. It's this the kind of stuff that comes up in, in dreams. Mm. Mm. For example, mm. Mm -hmm. and um, that, that's why a psychodynamic therapist, you know, you may, you may well feel uncomfortable at times working yeah. with a psychodynamic therapist. Mm. Not, not all the time, yeah. but um, the whole point is that when we're uncomfortable, it's because stuff comes up, but there's, there's, there's not the stuff we're used to just dealing with comfortably. Mm, mm. Um, so, so you know, if you're, if you're chatting with a, a good friend over coffee mm. about some some stuff that happened years ago, or something, yeah. something yeah. Else, or do you like this music? It's great, isn't it? Mm. You know, usually, we don't feel uncomfortable. Mm -hmm, mm. But if you go to see a psychodynamic therapist. The whole idea is to access the areas that we feel uncomfortable because it's, it's those areas. Yeah. yeah. Or rather, it's, it's, it's when, when we try to push away those areas out of existence, that's when we can get into trouble or problems in our life. So if we're making a mess of our relationship, for example, well, if we start to look at, looking at this other stuff, we might then make some links and understand more about how it relates to what we're doing over here that isn't helpful. Mm. Mm -hmm. Now, I'll, I'll, I'll say something more about um, the, the, the types of therapies. Because mm. um, psychodynamic therapy, I think, fits under the umbrella of explorative therapy. Mm. And in, the, in that same umbrella, I would put person-centered therapy, which is very different. Yeah. So if you're looking for a counselor or a therapist on, um, uh, on websites, yeah. yeah. You, you see one that says I'm psychodynamic, mm. and the next one says I'm person centered. Well, well they've both got the same aim. Their, their aim is to help you explore who you are. Mm. They do it very differently. Yeah. yeah. The, um, the, the, the person centered therapist um, famously, famously offers three. three Core conditions. conditions. Yeah. yeah. That's, 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 that's a jargon term, term for part of the method. method. Uh -huh. one, of one of the core, core conditions, conditions is unconditional, unconditional positive regard. regard. Yeah. yeah. You, could, you, could, you could say respect. respect. Right. right. You, 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 you value, the therapist values, values the other person yeah. Yeah. As, a, as a valuable human being. Uh -huh. All seven billion of us yeah. Yeah. on the planet. Even, even, even what you, even so called bad people. people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They, they come, come to, to see a person-centered person -centered therapist. therapist. The person the therapist will, will, will value, value that person as a person, person. Even, even though they're not the bad stuff. stuff. Right, right, right. right. Okay. yeah. yeah. Uh, and the, the second, second core condition, condition mm -hmm. is empathy. Yeah. yeah. So, so which, which is not sympathy. 
I'll tell, I'll tell you the difference. difference. So sympathy, sympathy is when someone, someone goes, oh, oh yeah, I know exactly, exactly what you're feeling. I've been through the same thing. thing. Right. right. Yeah. 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 Or, oh, that, oh, that sounds, sounds terrible. terrible. Right. right. Oh, I'm right. really sorry. sorry. Yeah. 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 So, so, what, 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 do you, you want, want a cup of tea? Let me put my arm around you. Comfort you. That's sympathy. Empathy is the ability to stand in someone else's shoes for a moment. It's, it's not, not to, to like, like be that other person, person but to, to kind of catch catch, catch, catch a flavour flavor of what it actually really is like to be that person. person. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you, you could, could say, say being understood. Being understood. Mm -hmm. someone, someone who, if you, if you receive empathy from, from your therapist, therapist mm -hmm. you, you may feel, feel understood. understood. Oh, yeah. 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 Someone yeah. understands what I'm going through. And that can help you Manage, manage your feelings. feelings. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Well, oh, well, well this, this is me. me. Uh -huh. you, know, you know, I've, uh -huh. I've, I've actually, actually felt, felt all this stuff, stuff that I've been, I've been able, able to say to my therapist. therapist. Uh -huh. my, my therapist has communicated to me. To me. Oh, oh, I see, I see um, Colin, Colin, or whatever your patient's, patient's name is. is. Uh -huh. uh, uh, it, it seems that when you did this, you did, you did it because, because of that, that and that made you feel so and so. Is that right? right? Mm. So, you, so can, you can you experience the empathy of the therapist. therapist. Mm. And, and the third of the core conditions, conditions is called uh, authenticity or mm -hmm. congruence. Oh, yeah. So, so the, the idea here is that the therapist, therapist is um, true, true mm -hmm. and honest to, to who they are. Mm -hmm. it, doesn't it doesn't mean to say that the person centered therapist will answer any question. It's not like the therapist is like. Answering, answering honestly, honestly everything. Mm. Mm. But mm. A, if, if you go and see a, a, a good, good person centered therapist, mm -hmm. you'll, you'll get, get the impression basically, basically no, no bullshit. bullshit. Oh. Right. Last time, yeah. I, I yeah. met someone who, who even, even though I don't know, know him very well, mm. I, just I just get this sense that we can, we can be, be real here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's can be such a relief because. A lot, a lot of the time, time when, when, when we, we get into, into, into a mess, mess yeah. Yeah. it's because we we, we too, too ashamed of being real. real. You know, you know like, like, oh, I'm, I'm not going to let that person understand, understand this about me. About me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm mm -hmm. not going to show my, my friends, friends that part of me because I don't like it. You know, yeah. Yeah. I'll just show them this part of me. And it's and and there's a psychological cost to doing that. You know, if we're kind of hiding part of ourselves, so if you go and see therapist. Um, it's, it's what's, what's so, so helpful, helpful is to stop, stop hiding. hiding. Right. Right. This, this is me. Uh -huh. so, so that's some, some of the differences between psychodynamic and person centered theory. Hi, so I hope you enjoyed that video and you got something from it. If you didn't, leave a dislike or maybe even just like the video. But more importantly, if you've got a question on mental health, maybe it's not related to what, what you were just watching. Maybe there's something else that's been burning inside you for a long time that you just need answers on um, but you can't go to therapy for whatever reason then leave your question in the comment section below and we will try our best to answer your question whether it's in written form in the comments or maybe it's a short video on instagram or a longer video on youtube whatever it is you want to do um, whatever it is you want to ask us sorry um, leave a comment below and we will try our best to answer your questions in future videos So whatever you do, please like this video comment if you liked it Leave a dislike if you didn't like it so we know if you didn't like it and until next time stay safe out there It's like COVID-19 at the moment <laughs>